I got a cat. Welcome, Chino. He is, uh, he's my cat. I just bought him, and, uh, honestly, he's the best cat I've ever seen. He is so chill. He is so confident. He's pretty agile. He's pretty strong. He's assertive. He's got, like, the best temper ever. I mean, he, like, eats me every once in a while and scratches me. But he's really good. He rode on my dash on the way home. Like, he's fearless. I'll take you guys on an adventure. Um, he's six months old, doesn't have a shots and hasn't been neutered, so we gotta do that. And the family that had him didn't really give us any information about him other than his age and the fact that he needs shots and to be snipped. Okay, in order to learn more about him, we're gonna put him through some tests. We're gonna put him through an agility test. We're gonna put him through an obedience test. We're gonna obviously give him the wiggle test. I mean, come on, you gotta give every cat the wiggle test. I don't like it too much, but he wiggles. I'm gonna put him through a water test, see if he likes water. We're gonna put him through a climbing test. We're gonna put him through a friendship test to see if he likes other cats. And I think that's all the tests he needs, only the six little quick tests. You don't wanna stress him out too much. He's still, a, he's still a kitten. We're also, just like in Emma's room, gonna be building him a nice little cat dominium so that he can live a nice life, nice cozy life in a beautiful cat penthouse. He wants to run away. Go ahead, bud. I don't know, he really loves us though. So say bye to Chino and let's get into this video. Oh, Emma. It smells like smoke. Cat. You're so chill. <laughs> Chino's completely in his own world, and Calisfer is just like studying him. This is what? Good job. Oh, it's okay. He just wants to smell you. <laughs> Calisfer's like, what did I do? Think they're gonna do drugs together? Absolutely. Oh! All right, and now I feel a little bad for this little guy because you know he's tired, he's sleepy, he's been through a lot these past few days. But unfortunately, we gotta put him through some tests so that we can get to know him better and see what he can really do. Because I really believe in him. He seems like an amazing cat, and uh, and I really think he can do great in these tests. You know, so it's on to testing time. He's so amazing, I love throwing him. Like, it's just fun. I throw him at people. Like, he's like a kill streak. I just grab him and chuck him. Oh, <laughs>
Anakin! I have the high ground! All you need to do is go to your local hardware store, or dollar store, anywhere that sells like floor mats or carpets, and just pick up a, a bunch of carpets. And then the only other thing you're gonna need is gonna be a staple gun. Woo! He just comes. Yeah, I think the obedience test might be a cakewalk for this cute little munchkin guy. Like, look at him. Look at him. How could you say no to this face? So to make your life easier, you're gonna want to start at the top just so that you don't run out of carpet at the top. It's like putting a little one at the top. No, I'm putting the little one at the bottom. Oh. Hide the ugliest one at the bottom. You can put this up wherever you want it. Don't put it up to your ceiling. You don't want to take up the room you have for LED lights if you ever want to put them in there if you already have them like me. Make sure like they're as close to touching as possible. Oh. I'm just waiting for the call from my mom to be like, shut the up. All right, let's see if he thinks it so far. Oh, it needs more staples. He does need more staples. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so we can climb it. It's good. I already tried to get up to the cubby, so that's a, a good thing, because at some point we are going to convert this into another cat dominium. So right up there in my cubby, it's going to be perfect. He has the coziest little spot built into my closet. It's right here, tucked in with all my clothes. We put a blanket down for him, and he just loves it. Because it's so secluded and dark when the lights are off, it's like a cave. He loves it in there so much. And then as a little bonus, because this one had already been cut for Emma's cat dominion, we can actually bend it around. He can have a little scratching area. And we're all done. Well, the scratching part of the wall, and then the rest of it, he can climb up. And then he can sneak up to that little cubby up there. Once we clean it all out, make it into a cute little cat dominium. And lucky for us, we already have shelves like all over the place. Cat food water bowl set, $35.99. Is it whisker safe? Yeah, look, look how it's tilted and how wide it is. Oh, okay. No hammock? It's the window hammock is adorable. So that's like $70. That's like $70 just for that little guy. This is lunch? This guy's scarfing it down. Benjamin! What? There's a cactus tree. How much are we about to spend on Amazon for a cat? Is my question. I just think it's cute. Oh my goodness. Why would we get him a water for $25? Like, they like moving water. That's kind of cool. They like moving water. Are we gonna get him a water bath? So we get him a water bath? I don't know. And then we can just get him one bowl. Yeah. So it'll bring down the price of the bowls a little bit. Oh no, a cat water fountain. This is brutal. Side note, I'm so allergic to him and my throat hurts. So I've just been woken up and informed that um our Amazon stuff that I forgot we ordered showed up this morning. So uh, let's unbox it and take a peek at what we got for our, the cutest little cat, Mr. Team over there. Let's take a peek what showed up at my door. A foldable cat window perch so he can look outside. We also got that was terrible. What? I'm just saying be careful, they're big. Yeah, they are. Oh my goodness. Whisker safe bowls that we now have to clean because they're covered in styrofoam. Oh look how good these look. And they're just all super whisker safe. So that you won't get whisker fatigue. I think he likes it. I mean, to be fair, he'll drink out of my cup, my glass, so. Oh my goodness. Yeah, he'll drink out of anything or eat out of anything. So I think the fact that he's getting spoiled really doesn't matter that much. But at least he won't get whiskered with you. Do you think you should do this? Um, do we need like the level or thing? Do you have a level? <laughs> Who says the box is level? Mises. Misa says. That looks like even. Yeah, kinda. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, and it folds too. Wow. It's a little. It's a little bulky. Well, like it's better than nothing. It is better than nothing. I hope it looks nice anyway. There you go. Kitty. All right, toss them up there. You like it? I think he likes it. Yeah. I think the window hammock's definitely a win. All right, Ballerama, Pet Smart Hall for little Tito, little Chino. 
Hello, Chi Chi. Look at his face. I love him. He's so adorable, isn't he? Dollarama slash PetSmart. You know, Dollarama's our favorite. We did it for Calisfer. We're doing it for Little Chi. We bought him a nice little scratching post that we can put up. You know, cheap, disposable, easy. Comes with some catnip when he's old enough. Obviously, we'll let him experiment. Number two. I don't know. He's also been rolling in like a catnip carpet. So we got him a nice little little one of these little chaser things, a little teaser, feather toy. Next item. So we already split these up uh, between our houses because we're taking them between both houses because like we can't choose where to live. But we bought him some springs, which uh, Calisfer is also enjoying. Anyway. We bought him a little, oh, a little jingly jangly balls, you know? He loves those, he just chasing it right now. A uh, little cat harness so that we can take him for walks in the nice uh, nice snow, see how much he likes it, you know? Take him for runs with us, you know, we're very active. We get out every day for a nice 6 a.m. run, so we can bring him with us. We also found the greatest deal at PetSmart. Do they even care about the flavors? No, probably not, but you gotta do like the block thing. Like, I don't know. No, 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 let's we'll just take it and we're just gonna... No, I don't know what I'm doing! I'm a pro vlogger. We got him 10. My favorite is the, the one with gravy on it. 12 of those for 10.95, okay? Steal of a deal, okay? And then we also bought him a nice little cute, it's not that cute, nice blue litter box. You know, it's cheap, it's easy, it's fun. It's, it's, it's temporary. It's temporary and it works. And he likes receipts. He knocked it out of my hands. He, he knocked his room. litter box out of my hands. It's all Chino's fault. It's all Chino's fault. All right, well, I hope everyone enjoyed meeting Chino and seeing how cute he is. We're currently in the process of making him a nice little house and working towards getting him his very own cat dominium. So in the next video, you'll see us building it. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. If you enjoyed this video and enjoy me or Chino, be sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.